When we go into practice, for instance, if you have a two hours practice, too often now we notice that we are coming back to a point we didn't want to go back in the past where one player was doing the exercise and the other one was just blocking and sharing the ball. If you analyze that in two hours practice, you have 30 minutes there where you just block and very often the position on their leg is not good. They take a comfort position when they are like this on the right leg, while when they are in the game, they should come from forehand to backhand, backhand, forehand, and then when they move, they are more often here to block, not there. And it goes so far that sometimes I see players that are there. They play backhand here, wait on the right leg when the ball is coming there, they don't know what is happening, okay? So, one way to go and to change the, or to improve quickly, let's say like that, is to emphasize your practice more what you will do when you are in the game. So, that's basically the first three balls. So, let's say that now, too often I see back and back and for and for and it's what just reflexes. Now, just think that instead of that, you will start to play short, short. To improve a little bit feeling, to try to keep that ball low, not especially to put backspin because it changed now, but to try to play one or two times. Weight of the body, it's here on the right leg. Do that two, three minutes. Then after you say, you, your play okay, one or two, then you flip. Then you will flip, and then you will go in back end, back end. Short, 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 flip, back end, back end. So when you think that, you train already the first step, forward, backward, which is key in the game, and then after you practice back end push or back end short, flip, block, and then acceleration. And then you can go back in different kind of back end. But you will start with that. You will notice also that many, many players cannot just make a short uh, service with back end. Too often they go with something too complicated. Then if you do that five, six, seven minutes, imagine then you can do that with forehand. If you cannot sh serve short with forehand, you can just start here. Then you go and then you try. And then you will see if your player is here, is there, if he is too short, no. Then after the same, two, three minutes, up, up, flip, and then you go into the position. It can be counter, it can be after loop, whatever. Okay? Now you can do also the same on the line because often we train cross, but the line is very important. So it can be backhand against forehand. Flap, and then we go here. Come here, and then we change. So if you analyze, you can play 20, 25, 30 minutes in warming up mode, and you will have done a lot of your practice.